Well, hello there, everybody. What I want to talk about today is just show you a cool little patent pending feature in Option Colors. And I'll try to do more of these videos. I think it's some uh, form of actionable um, content that I can add to my YouTube channel. And so, yeah, I'll try to do some more. I've just been really busy working on the software, all the designs, and teaching people how to trade, designing trading systems, and things like that. So yeah, if you're interested in our programs, remember um, sjoptions.com. That's where you learn to trade options, and we develop trading systems and provide trading rules and education to the traders. And then optioncolors.com is where you can find the software. And I um, hope you enjoy this little tutorial today. Let me get started. So we're just looking at this um, feature in the software called Up or Down. And what this does is it actually predicts the um, direction of volatility and it gives you probability that that particular change in volatility will occur. So for example, I did a little scan here for a five point drop in volatility and then option colors found these different tickers. Okay, now from here, I could simply select one, I already selected Apple, and then I know that the volatility has a 70% probability to drop five points. So I can build a trade, something like a short Vega um, strategy and drop that volatility and analyze it. And it just gives me some ideas that I can really take advantage of. The other cool thing is these aren't just probabilities that we're estimating. These are actual real statistical probabilities. So what we've done with this patent pending application is we've created you know, our own formulas that will um, calculate and predict the direction of volatility you know, to any change like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven percent, whatever you want um, to know. And the software you know, will give you and issue these um, calls for you. And then it tracks them all, you know, you can see all the times that it's right and all the times that it's wrong. It's really kind of a form of artificial intelligence that you have working for you at all times and just does a lot of work for you, a lot of calculations. And the goal there is really to give you these actionable, you know, trade ideas um, that you can implement into your trading. Again, you can apply any of your own uh, strategies to these, but the key is, you know, that you know you have a 70% chance that the balls and out there are going to drop five points. And that's just really cool. Um, you can also change it. For example, let's go to two, see what happens. Now you have almost a 90% chance uh, that the balls are going to drop two points and so on. Uh, let's see if anything appears with a 10% drop. And here's your calculations on that. So 10% drop, a little bit less likely. So here we are. I built a basic butterfly spread. And again, we know that there's a high probability that the volatility is going to drop on this at least five points. So what I can do is come over here, drop my vols like five points and, you know, and then look at these returns. So with one standard deviation move, you know, we're looking at 40% a return, two standard deviation, 16, um, almost, well, three standard deviations to make uh, 13%. And I can go all the way to 100 and see it's averaging 12%. Now, another patent pending feature in the software is this blue blob you see behind risk profile, which is all my statistics that show me, you know, all these price moves that Apple has done over a 12 day period. And that includes 439 tests, which I can see down here. Pretty cool. So again, these are just um, tools that I've been designing over the last decade um, that are just game changers to the industry and you won't find anywhere else and they're all patent pending. So you only get them here at option colors. So anyway, that's one example, but just remember, you know, that Apple has earnings coming up, so uh, things can be very different, but just want to show you how the tool can find various tickers and predict the changes in volatility. Let's go back and let's look for something that's going the other way. So again, we can look for up or down. That's what I call the feature. And let's look for something that has maybe a high probability of, of moving up five points. So Tesla has a 69% chance the vol is to move up five points. Let's go down to maybe three points and see how high that gets. So three points, you're looking at an 80% probability. Again, I can simply click here, see all my statistics on that, all the times that it's right, all the time that it's wrong. So again, I know it's just not some theoretical calculation, but it's actually statistics. Again, let's look at something with a 
um, long vega position and model that into the software and see what we get. So first, I'm just gonna look at a straddle position. And again, we have that information. There's a high probability that the volatility is gonna increase five points on this, right? Now, if it happens really fast, you can see a return here, but it's gonna happen sometime within the next 30 days. So we see that 28 days into the trade that this is gonna average a loss of 6%. And it needs really a two standard deviation move just to break even. If you get three, you're looking at 2%. So again, you can quickly decide and analyze if that's a good trade to take. Next, let's take a look at a calendar spread. So here we are with our calendar. We have two different months and we're going to put 28 days back into this. And with a one standard deviation move, we're looking at about a 10% return to nothing. But let's also increase this volatility by five points. And we see that we have a 15% average return with one standard deviation move. Then we have a 6% with 95, and we have a 4% with 98, and even a 2% return, including all the statistics. So as you can see from that quick analysis that the calendar is really the superior um, long vega strategy to use on Tesla uh, right now. Again, there could be earnings coming out, I don't know, so you always have to be careful with that. But again, it's just an example of you know how quickly you can find trading opportunities in option colors and model them and apply statistics to your trade. So you really have a, a solid um, foundation for placing any trade and, and it's a totally different approach than you'll find in any other platform again because it's all based on statistics you know the volatility uh, calculation that we looked at in prediction that's all statistics and then our returns here that we're looking at these probabilities are based on statistics so it's not just your ordinary mundane software package that analyzes things like the old way um Anyway, if you guys like that video, give it a thumbs up. If you like the content, please subscribe, tell your friends, and thank you once again for being a follower. And I, you know, I'll try to do some more videos. I've just been so busy designing the software and working on the tools, but I'll try to get some more out there for you guys. So thanks once again. <laughs>